Hello everyone, this is JR Tactical 213 um, I'm starting this YouTube channel up. I am not an instructor, I'm not a trainer, I'm just the normal person that enjoys their firearms, um, enjoys shooting, and enjoys um, the knowledge that you can gain um, from research. Today I'm going to be talking to you about one of my concealed carry holsters that I just purchased. It comes from Tier 1 Concealment. It is the Aegis, A-G-I-S. There are a few other options out there with Tier 1 Concealment, um, but I went with their standard Aegis. One of the things that I really liked um, about this holster was the idea that I had a mag holder, something that came with it. So I had that extra mag that was always going to be with me when I'm carrying. I was a little skeptical or nervous about purchasing a holster that comes out to this price point. One of the reasons why is that, again, I'm looking at appendix carry and I'm not the smallest guy. I'm around six foot two, 270 pounds. So putting money out for a holster that, you know, you cannot return. I mean, you make it, um, this is what it is, um, was a little nerve wracking. Um, I, I decided to go for it. An instructor I had, he showed me the one he had for his SIG. The quality looked amazing. He had nothing but great to say about it. So I purchased it. I got it in this gray and then this like bright green. Um, when I received it, I could see the quality in this thing. I mean, every corner, every part of it has been um, looked through and, and taken care of. There's no sharp, sharp spots on it at all. Um, I mean, it is, it is a high quality product. I like the claw on this. This is a, a great claw that's gonna help pull the butt of the gun in when you have your um, belt tightened up. I chose the option for the clips to be one on the mag holder and one on um, the holster for the gun, um, just in case I did want to separate that. But these clips are plastic clips and they look to be strong, look to be of good quality. You do have the ability to raise and lower for a ride height on both. Um, tightening here on the claw will help with your retention. So you have the ability for retention. And then you have the ability to actually unsnap this and separate this so you can just have the gun or you can put the mag in another area. Now, uh, this, this is an amazing holster. I do highly recommend Tier 1. You will have a little wait right now as we are in the COVID era um, that their time frames will be probably anywhere from um, three to five weeks is my guess. Mine I think came in about four weeks. Um, so just know that there will be a slight wait for it. Um, for my body type with this one, again, there's nothing I can say negative about this. This is a great, great holster. But for my body type, uh, I have a little bit of that, um, a little bit of the belly. So what happens for me is that I have to have the setting so it's set up the highest so it rides the lowest, if that makes sense. Um, I need the lowest ride so my gun does not push out due to having a little bit of a belly. So when I lower it down, it can hide underneath some. Um, with that, I found that this area here caused some pain. It was a little uncomfortable. Uh, it would hit right in that pelvic area. And it is a wide amount that you're covering. Look at the green. It's, it's, it's a wide um, holster down here at the bottom. So um, that was one of the problems I had and something for me to figure out. Again, not anything against the holster. It's not the holster's issue. It's just my body type. 
Again, and I won't say enough, this is an amazing holster. I had to um, do a little bit of research and work to figure out how I can make it a little more comfortable for me. Um, and as I turn this around, you may have seen some of these little black dots on here. These are Velcro dots. Um, what these are, um, it goes to another product, which I will go into detail later on in another video. Just to do a quick showing. Um, this is called the Clinger Cushion, and it's got Velcro on it. It will Velcro on, and it takes care of that, that edge of the kydex digging in. Again, I'll show that in another video. So how does the gun fit into the holster, and how does the Mac fit in? Let me get my shield, and I carry it loaded. It is now cleared. I'll grab one of my unloaded magazines, put everything off to the side. The gun, when you fit it in, you'll hear a nice little audible click. It has great retention, and again, you can adjust to how you like it. So you can see there's a good retention to it. Got a perfect fit all the way around. I opted for the high sweat guard. Um, most of the time I will wear an undershirt, but if I don't, I do like having that little bit of the sweat guard. I went for the high one. I don't find that it digs in because again, it's really the height of my gun. Um, but they do have the option for medium and like no sweat guard. Um, but the gun fits in perfect. It um, is fully covered. You have your trigger, of course, covered. Um, you can get to your um, your mag release with this um, with your gun in. But you can put a mag. You can put a mag in, and of course, you can release it without um, having to take it out of the holster. Now, there's different setups you can have when you order this for which way you want to have uh, your mag facing. So I did it with the bullets facing the gun. So turn this way, slips right in, and that's what it looks like. I don't, you don't get any kind of audible click, but you can feel that it's, it's in there. And again, you do have retention adjustment for that right here. But this is the six rounder and that fits in pretty flush with this gun. If I were to go to a seven plus one with a hive, which is an eight, this does have ammo in it. It will sit a little higher. So depending on how this works with your body type, you may be able to run a longer mag. If you're looking for a great appendix carry holster that you can put your gun in and have an extra mag with you and have the ability to remove this and not have to have the mag if you don't want, check out Tier 1 Concealment. Highly recommend this holster. It's worth the money. It's going to last. You won't regret it. Thank you. Have a great day.